I really enjoyed all of Homer Scissorhands. This is the 20th episode of the 22nd season of The Simpsons, directed by Mark Kirkland and Mike B. Anderson. Being a huge Tim Burton fan, Edward Scissorhands fan, I was curious to see where the parallels would be. And basically, Homer learns that he's really good at cutting hair. And other people, all women, learn about this. And he opens a salon and everything seems to be going really well. But Homer very quickly realises that it's really tedious to have to listen to his customers just go on and on and on while they're in the chair, whinging about their life and, you know, trying to gossip, I guess. But he's unable to stop giving great haircuts. What is he going to do? Well, I won't say what happens, but I will say I loved it. I thought it was brilliant. Um, the scene where, where he was spinning the chair and every time he spun the chair, we saw a different client. I thought that was very well done beautifully done the pacing's great great mix of hairstyles great mix of different characters in this and ultimately what happened with this narrative I really liked also Marge's hair wow I won't describe it I won't give it away but keep your eye out for Marge's hair it is stunning absolutely beautiful so I really liked that part of the narrative then we have a narrative with Milhouse Milhouse watches Finding Nemo and he learns that Nemo had a mother and no longer has a mother, and basically he's learned about death. And he decides to no longer um, put on any, put anything on hold, he wants to live life to the fullest, he declares his love for Lisa, but instead of ending up with Lisa, he starts to date a girl called Taffy, voiced by the brilliant Kristen Schaal, and Lisa doesn't understand how Taffy could like Milhouse, so she begins to dig a little deeper, but in doing so, she learns that maybe she likes Millhouse. And I won't say any more than that. But again, I really liked how it ended up. I liked how this narrative developed. I liked what it gave us. I thought it was really good fun. Lisa's character in particular was very fascinating. And she did some unpredictable things that I won't describe. But certainly she made it go in a very interesting direction. So both of them, I really liked both the main narrative and Lisa's story uh, I thought they worked very well we didn't get too much of Bart in this unfortunately but not every episode can be full of Bart I guess it's an episode I liked it worked very well really had a lot of fun with it loved the scene in Moe's when Homer was talking to Moe and then he started to see everything yeah definitely an enjoyable episode I have no complaints about this at all